my name is Chloe Mondazir, and I'm here with my daughter, Nyla Mondazir, and we are here for the year of return. I thought it was important for my daughter to experience Africa because we have African descent, and um, I feel like we, we should learn more about the culture. So we're here to celebrate and um, learn as much as we can. Nyla, you want to tell them about your experience so far? All right. <laughs> Um, well, I, I'm really loving Ghana. I like um, how much things there are to do, like the Bolti Falls, Sagba Falls. Um, I think it was a really nice experience to come here because where I live, my school is predominantly Hispanic, so I'm usually the only black person in my class. So it's good to see a lot of people of, um, that who are African American um, because I don't see that a lot and it's like I'm home. So I really like it here. Lots of people always think Africa is just like, there's always lions and um, zebras everywhere. And um, I learned that it's not always that. It's, it's, there's places to go, things to do. It's not just land. Uh, a lot of people also think that they're, that Africa is just poor. But I've learned that um, Africa is not poor and that actually there's lots of queens, queens and kings that have come from here, diamonds, gold. <laughs> I recently found that out. Um, so I'm looking forward to buying some actually. So this experience means so much more to me to be here 400 years later after the slave trade um, with my daughter because uh, those Africans never got to return. But we are here in their honor, and there's a, a huge sense of identity that I didn't have before, and I thought it was important for my daughter to feel that at a very young age, to know who she is and where she comes from and what she stands for. And I'm hoping that she goes back even more empowered um, as an African-American woman and, and more connected to her roots.